Hey guys, how's the game going? Welcome to day nine of the Hokkaido trip. Woke up this morning with a tasty hangover. Yeah, I didn't. I'm still knackered. I thought I was going to be all refreshed staying here, but that's, that's definitely not the case. But today's going to be a good day. We're going to see the crane with the red head. We're going to go to an oyster festival. And that's all I can remember right now. But I'm going to check out the hotel where we stayed last night, get in the van, and uh, let's go get day nine on the go. Okay, so we just checked out another decent cape. Now we're gonna drive through the wetlands to get to the oyster festival. Munch some oysters. So we're driving down the wetlands and there's a crane over there. I don't know if it's the one with the red head, but it's a definitely a big crane. Let's go and check it out. Oyster. So up these steps is some kind of shrine and it's a tsunami safe zone. I just want to see what a tsunami safe zone looks like. Alright, so we just arrived at the Oyster Festival. Let's go check it out. Alright, so we've just come up this little bridge so we can overlook the festival here. You can rent barbecues, that's what everybody's doing. It starts from 800 yen for one about this big, up to massive ones. And you go around, buy all the stuff you want to buy. It's not only oysters, you can get prawns or scallops, all that kind of stuff. And then you sit down, drink, cook up your food. The guy's blasting them over there, it looks pretty good. Everything's fairly priced too.
This is the best crab I've had yet. So good, wow. Sweet, a little bit salty. Just, just so good. Unbelievable. So the food is so nice, it's really fresh. They don't even season it with anything, it's just the cooked, fresh seafood. It's really good. All right, so we're leaving the oyster festival now. Mate, that crab was so good. And we're gonna go and get more food, right? We're gonna go to town, we're gonna go to Kushiro, and then we're gonna get a bowl of food where you pick all the different bits of like seafood you want on the top of the rice. I'll show you when we get there. Fish place. Let's go. So first you gotta buy your bowl of rice and then you can walk around just choosing whatever you want. cheap though and you can easily spend a lot of money in there okay so we're on our way to see the redhead crane that bowl was so nice you could get basically anything you wanted even whale was being served in there you get veggies just a good market nice tasty fresh food it's a little bit expensive but it's worth it for the experience as well you know So I thought it was going to be like a big open, like a national park kind of a thing and they were just mooching around. It's more like a zoo. Let's walk around anyway. Nice bird. to sleep tonight in the van we don't know whether to go down right to the south of Hokkaido or just drive through the middle because we actually have to give the car back tomorrow 10 days of we hired it for so we're gonna have a look at some options and I want to stay somewhere pretty nice like on a lake or something not just one of them roadside areas that we've been sleeping in so we'll go and have a look leave this place find a good decent place to sleep tonight feeling good after that bowl
sleep here tonight. You've got the ocean, the nice sunset. You've got a Lawson convenience store there. So we're just going to sleep here. I'm knackered. <laughs> okay, so day nine is coming to an end. A little bit of whiskey before we set up the um, back of the bed. Got this little ice from the convenience store. For another good day in Hokkaido. I'll see you in a bit. <laughs>